Chile, Kuala Lumpur, Jakarta, Miami, and tonight we are spreading the love in Buenos Aires. The cadets welcome you to the glorious celebration of the 650th episode of A State of Searching for new horizons. And now, Ruben Duran.
amigos e amigas. Welcome to a new chapter in the exciting stories of a state of trance. I'm Ahmed Van Buren and you are tuned in to the sixth main event of the New Horizons World Tour. The third continent in one month. Kicked off in Moscow, Almaty, Yegat, Rienberg. And I'm still buzzed about the world's largest trance event that ever took place in the Jarbers in the Netherlands in Utrecht. Yesterday we had an amazing event in Santiago de Chile. More about that in a little bit. All the sets were recorded and will be broadcasted at a later date. You can find updates about that on the website. In case you're listening to the radio right now, there's a live video stream available. Simply go to stateoftrans.com. See and hear everything that's happening here in Buenos Aires tonight. And in case you already joined the broadcast, you can see I'm not alone in the studio. With me is Gijs Alkemade. He's the guy that's responsible for all the connections, make sure that everything happens. And the whole team that you don't see here backstage... You've, you've been in Buenos Aires for a few days already, eh? Yeah, I arrived on uh, Monday because uh, I've been with ASOT in uh, Buenos three years ago. And yeah. I thought this is such a great city. If I got the chance uh, to go there and ASOT is paying for the tickets, then uh, I'm going a couple of days up front to see it. And I love this. Yo, what, what did you did you experience anything fun? Yeah, I went to a couple of parks. I went to some art galleries. I bought some Beatle records for a fair price. So uh, oh. <laughs> I, I, I had a good time here. I had a good time. Guys, you will go on investigation again today, but I have to warn you guys, the Argentinian crowd is one of the wildest on the planet. So make sure you're careful, okay? Well, there's one word that's really dangerous over here, and that's legging. It's, it's <laughs> girl, leg? girls in leggings, it's <laughs> weird. It's still so early here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So what do we have in store for you tonight? I will reveal a news about Ibiza later on. A scoop. We'll confirm some of the rumors or not. Still to come tonight as well, local heroes Chris Schweitzer, Heat Beat and Big Guns, Orion Nielsen and Dash Berlin. Followed by myself doing a two-hour set for 22,000 people here tonight. But I'm afraid I also have some bad news. Unfortunately, there'll be no performance of Ali and Fila tonight. But let's try and call Fadi to see what happens. Fadi, where uh, where are you right now? Um, actually, right now I'm uh, in uh, Santiago uh, Airport. Yeah. Leaving, uh, sadly, I'm leaving back home now. Why is that? Why are you not playing for us tonight? Very bad luck and misunderstanding, problems with the embassy, the Argentinian embassy in Cairo, giving us wrong info, uh, not the correct visa at this time. So I had to stay, actually, I had to stay 24 hours in the airport. I was stuck in the airport for 24 hours. I had to wait. I couldn't get into the country. Actually, before I went to Chile, so you were stuck in the airport in Buenos Aires for 24 hours, and you couldn't leave. You couldn't get into Argentina. No. Wow, that's talking about bad luck, man. But we will see you again very, very soon. Of course, on the state of trance, and we will keep following you. Thanks, man. Okay, can I say a message to the Argentinian crowd? Yeah, of yeah, course. Okay. Well, I wanted to tell them that I'm really sad that I can't make it. And for me, missing this party tonight, especially with you, state of trance, the biggest trance party in the world, and with the best crowd in the world, the Argentinian crowd, I'm really, you can imagine how much I'm sad and we really did our best to be there, but I'm sorry and hopefully we're going to make it up soon. And hopefully maybe with you, maybe we can do a party together in Argentina. For sure, for sure, man. Well, don't worry, the Argentinian fans, I know this for sure, they, they understand. Of course, they were sad that you're not here, but uh, we will play some tracks in your dedication and we will see you very soon again in Argentina, okay? Sure, mate. Thanks, Armin, so much. Thanks for your support, man. In fact, we will see Fadi very soon in Miami. He will join us for the live broadcast. And to fill in for Ali and Fila, we thought of something special. We asked Thomas Heredia to play the closing set. But there will be a very special back-to-back -back action happening with Thomas Heredia. So make sure you tune in all the way till the end. We'd love to hear from you again. Let us know where you are celebrating a set of Tron 650. Use the hashtag AOT650AR throughout the several social medias. We're reading along with you right now with our social media team. And record a message with your phone, microphone, and upload it to a special upload button on thestateoftrons.com to hear your shout out in this broadcast. Enough of the talking for right now. Let's enjoy this sound of Ruben de Ronde live from Buenos Aires.
Celebrating 650 episodes of the weekly radio show, A State of Trance. This is Ahmed Van Buren talking to you live from Ciudad del Rock in Buenos Aires. And on stage right now, Ruben de Ronde. He helps with the show every week. So it makes me proud to see him like this. Yesterday we had the first New Horizons event in South America in Santiago de Chile. It was the first time I did a show like that. I played a couple of events in Chile, but never a State of Trance. And I gotta say, my mind was blown, you know, in a very good way. One of the artists that performed there is in the studio with me right now. Thomas Herrera. Thomas, what happened? Well, how, how was it yesterday for you? Well, it was amazing as well. Uh, I never expect, you know, like a friendly cloud. Yeah. It was like everyone jumping on the tracks, on the drops. On, an, on the breakdowns like these, you know? <laughs> I know. It was amazing, yes. For people that don't know you, you're from Argentina. Yes, I'm from Argentina. And you live in Buenos Aires. Yeah, I live in Buenos Aires. So do you play often in Chile? Uh, no, it was my second time. Only it second time? was last year, the first one, at Ultra Buenos Aires. Okay. And is there a rivalry between Chile and Argentina? or? No, no. I don't think so. Okay. Think so. <laughs> hey, thank you so much for uh, uh, filling in for Ali and Fila. Unfortunately, they can't do their set tonight. They were supposed to play after me here in Buenos Aires, but due to visa problems, and we really tried everything, and Fila's flying home right now. It makes me feel so sad. But thank yeah, you so course. much for uh, for doing this. Thank you very much for traveling. <laughs> we'll, uh, you'll be the main DJ, but um, well, I can't really reveal everything that we're going to do, but there's going to be some back-to-back -back action. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> Are I'm you looking ready for forward that? to it. Yeah. I think we have to play, you know, a couple of Ali and Fila tracks, just as, and yes. as respect for them. Of course. So thanks again for stopping by, Thomas. Have fun and looking forward to hear your set. Thank oh, you by the much. way, all the sets of last night were recorded and will be broadcasted soon on the State of Sundays on Sirius XM. And guys, I wonder if the people found us again on, on social media. Oh, they really did. Alina Alexandrovna writes, I am watching all this magic. I don't want to go to sleep already, even though it's so late over here. I got a tweet from Brandon Thompson. He just tweeted that. He's putting a video on full screen for full pleasure. You can do that. 
Shouting out to Orjan Nielsen. He's in the hotel now preparing his set for the night and tuned in to the video stream. Hey, Orjan, uh, how are you doing? Hi, how are you doing? Oh, that reminds me, if you have any tracks you'd like to hear, play me or Dash Berlin or Tomas or Heatbeat or any of the other guys. Use the hashtag ASG650AR and use hashtag MyHorizon if you're sharing pictures where you're listening from. In a couple of minutes, we'll hear what Gijs and Ruben talked about in the rec room. But now, back to the stage. Back to Ruben de Ronde.
of the driving forces behind the State of Trance radio show. Ruben helps me every week with uh, downloading tracks, setting up competitions. And it makes me proud to see him on the main stage here in Buenos Aires. And we'd like to know a little bit more about Ruben. So Gijs went into the rec room with Ruben. The rec room. I started my own label statement, I think almost 10 years ago. And uh, after working on that for a couple of years, I started working for Armada and for Armin. And that's where we are now. So. And then kind of a passion for radio erupted because now you're very much involved with uh, a state of trends, but also with your own career. Why do you make the musical choices you do? Because it's not the exact Armada trends you're playing in your sets. Kind of true because it's more progressive than, uh, than others do maybe. And you're totally right about the radio, uh, making radio. It's uh, so much fun to share your music and to tell something about it so yesterday you've been into the studio with Chris Schweitzer right here in Buenos Aires Argentina I had a lot of fun yesterday with Chris because it's quite a travel from here to go to Chris's house I think it was like 20 miles or something what to tell about Chris I really like going there and he has a lot of nice cute dogs so if you ever see Chris and talk to him say that uh, Emma is a really cute dog <laughs> you like the dog yeah the rec room
traveling to nine wonderful cities. Through the freezing heights and deepest valleys of the Ural Mountains, the signal found its target at the center of Eurasia. That night, we were celebrating a state of trance 650 at the exhibition center in Yekaterinburg. I'm glad we got the chance to show the world how big and beautiful this city is and how the inhabitants are able to party the whole night long. And it may have been very cold outside, but inside, thousands of the State of Trance lovers warmed up the dance floor. People from all across the world were able to tune into the live broadcast and be part of this special show. Online, people sent thousands of tweets, pictures, and shared their State of Trance experience at home. They were even trending worldwide on Twitter. State of Trance 650 Day Katarinburg, for me, was incredible. Spreading the love for Trance. We welcome you to our new journey, going further and further. Expand your world, Day Katarinburg.
I don't know if you're watching the live stream right now. But then you can see it's really going off already. Incredible. Alexander Popov. Of course, he's from Russia. But he's an amazing trance producer live here right now from Yekaterinburg on the New Horizons World Tour. And Ruben de Ronde just came off the stage. Yes. How was it, man? Incredible. I mean, you normally don't have it at the normal club night if you play the first set that it's already going off like this. So I know, yeah. Only at a state of France. <laughs> I gotta say, respect that you really build up your set as well and not throwing immediately all the big anthems in, really building it up. Well, it, it's only an hour set and normally I build even a little bit more with a little bit more progressive stuff. But uh, yeah, it's always nice to play the first set because you can really build up, play some progressive tunes and I prefer that. Yep. Well, thank you so much, Ruben. We will see you again on the 1st of March in Buenos Aires, Argentina for a live set. And of course, you'll be there for every live thing that we do on this New Horizons tour. And a little bit, we have the big room, or should I say Bigfoot Giants in the studio, Willem and Bart. But right now on stage, Alexander Popov.
Trans 650. Hello Armin, this is Daniel Kansky and congratulations to 650 episodes of A State of Trans. Much love and support from Lebanon. Hey Armin, this is Manuel Rodriguez from Boca Raton, Florida. I just want to give a shout out to Maria Paula Hernandez from Bogota, Colombia. The State of Trans 650. New Horizons. This is A State of Trans. Hashtag ASOM 650.
What a vibe here in Jekaterinburg. Use the hashtag ASOT650RU on social media. We'd love to know where you're listening from and how you're enjoying the episode so far. Don't forget to share your pictures using the hashtag MyHorizon. We actually have some really great packages of exclusive State of Trance merchandise and CDs. And you can win a meet and greet at one of the coming events if you upload your picture using the hashtag MyHorizons. We've got some really cool pictures already. Yesterday, we had one of the very first non-broadcasted main events of the New Horizons Tour. I'm very pleased to say that if you tune in to the normal episode of A State of Trance this week, that you can listen to the highlights of some of the sets. On stage, I was joined by great artists like Rank One, Omnia, Ram Solar Stone, and the Maltese duo Tunisia. And on the phone right now, he used to be part of the famous duo Bas and Ram, and he created one of the biggest monsters of last year, Ramelia. Besides being a DJ and producer, he's also organizing a wider range of events with grotesque Rambone. And to give you a little bit of an idea what happened, I gave him a call just before tonight's broadcast, and I asked him how his set was and how his debut went. It was amazing. Very nice crowd, a great setup of the stage. Uh, didn't know what to expect from Kazakhstan, but it rocked, so uh, I had a great time. Yeah, I saw you briefly uh, on the stage uh, when I walked off. They don't have events like this in Kazakhstan, so it was really unexpected for me, but I saw that they knew the tracks, and uh, did you have the same experience, that they knew your music and stuff? Yeah, exactly. They just on all the tracks, all the vocal tracks, they knew everything. I was also very surprised by that. The listeners uh, right now that listen to the show in uh, Yekaterinburg, they weren't there last night. Can you describe the event in your own words? Oh, simply amazing. It was a big show, big setup for the stage, uh, very enthusiastic crowd, everybody was full on uh, into the music, so yeah, it was a great experience. Uh. I have a really good news for the for the fans of uh, DJ Ram. Uh, your set has been recorded and we will broadcast this this week on A State of Trance 650 Part 2. So this Thursday, tune in to A State of Trance. You will hear some of the highlights. And if you want to hear the entire set by DJ Ram, make sure you tune in to Sirius XM. Thanks, Ram. Thank you for making time for us. See you again soon. Keep rocking those tunes because uh, I heard some of your new stuff. and It's really impressive. Thank you. We will see you very soon, man. Thanks again. Thank you. Take Thank care. You. Have a good night. Thank you. Bye-bye. You and millions of other trans fans are joining us on our search for new horizons. This is a state of trans. And right now, on stage, one of my favorite producers of the moment, Alexander Popov.
Marsha, is there anybody out there? I think you're a bit quiet. I can't hear you. Did you know that people can heal you all around the world? This is a state of drugs. And let the world know how proud you are of Alexander Popov. Come on.
This is a state of trance, the first major event of this amazing New Horizons tour. I'm so happy that the room is already so full. I mean, it's still pretty early on the night here in uh, Yekaterinburg. Looking at the screens here we have in the studio, the show at the Expo Center is, well, let's put it that way, I'm quite speechless. Luckily, I have a duo here that don't know the word speechless. Willem and Bart of W&W. How are you guys? Very Great, good. You? Yeah, very good. Um, are you guys ready? Of course. <laughs> You just told me in the dressing room that you are going to play a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of new material. A lot, yes. actually. A lot of unfinished stuff. We just, just made, just for, especially for this event, I think a lot of stuff from our new la from our label. Yeah. And a new remix for Gareth Emery. The okay. New track. We nice. Have the, we have the whole month off, so we have, have So does that make you extra prepare. nervous if you play so many new tracks? Yes. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. always yeah. curious to see what to expect. We were always uh, curious what people uh, think. So. So a lot of things uh, have changed for you, right? Ever since the first gigs at Set of Trance 400? Yes, that was the first gig we actually did together. That's Is that? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was. Wow. And look at you now, sky high. <laughs> okay, spill the beans. Bigfoot. Because uh, maybe the camera can go down on the on the feet of, of the guys. and, and, and <laughs> Especially shoot. Wart. Oh, who's, 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 who has big feet? I, Wart. I have uh, size <laughs> 50. So how did you come up with the idea to make a, a, a track about your feet? No, it's, it's actually the, the, Willem's idea. I, I came into <laughs> the, the studio title. and we had that track. And like Bigfoot was like on the news and stuff. And when I looked at his feet, I was like, Bigfoot. <laughs> Bam, that's named Bigfoot. So who's the vocal in the track? That's him. That's actually <laughs> Bigfoot. <laughs> Like <laughs> one, one, one more time, how do you do that? Big foot. <laughs> and then pitch down a couple of times. All right, we're looking forward to your set. Thank you so much for coming down here, guys. Thank Thanks you very so much. much Stay tuned. In about 20 minutes, these guys will rock your world. Live in video and audio. But now, let's return fast to Alexander Popov. <laughs>
I tell you a little secret? Can I tell you a little secret that I'm secretly a massive Alexander Popov fan? Did you check out his album? Seriously. And did you know that he actually has a different name in Russian? We're coming live to you from the Expo Center in Yekaterinburg. Outside it's minus 25 degrees Celsius. Inside it's heating up. And right before his set, Ruben caught up with Alexander to talk about his sets and more. The Rec Room, Ruben Durand. So Alexander, you premiered a new track called Quantum during last uh, Thursday's broadcast, showcasing a little bit broader sounds. Is that something that we'll hear on the follow-up of Personal Wave? Well, yeah, the new track sounds a bit different than my latest works, but I don't think I will change my style a lot. I think uh, in Quantum you can also hear uh, some kind of Alexander Popov melodies, but we'll try to do something maybe fresh, but I'll stay in trance for sure. So you're a married man and you have a beautiful baby right now. With a life on the road, is it really hard? And how do you stay in touch with your family back home? Nowadays, it's not so difficult. You can uh, call on Skype or send a text in WhatsApp. That's what I'm doing. And we usually uh, in touch with my uh, wife. She shows me my boy, how he's doing. So it's okay for me. The Rec Room. Rec Room. Alexander Popov ripping it up here in the stage. Don't forget to send us your messages on Twitter. Hashtag ASOT. 650RU. And in about five minutes, main stage, W&W. But first, the last tracks of Alexander Popov. Thank you. 